We're back. I'm joined by Jennifer Thompson, the founder of The Healing Justice, Clarence, Nancy, and Ricky, as well as Mark Godsey from the Ohio Innocence Project. Also in the audience, we have Dr. Eugene Lipov, who is a PTSD specialist. And I, I will say that having talked about post-traumatic stress, we use the word injury now often because it's, it's not really a disorder. This is an injury that you all sustained. In looking at your three phases, what, what, would it, what would it mean or feel like for you all to just be able to sleep at night? That would be one, the most, one of the wonderful, you know, most wonderful things in my life because I sleep probably three to four hours on and off. I would love to be able to sleep six hours. Solid. Yeah. I toss and turn all night. I mean, it's just, I take anxiety medication at night just to try to get some good sleep or I don't. I'm just like tossing and turning all night. It's just like your brain just doesn't want to shut down. Rick, you say uh, you I go would just days. like to just be able to relax, or of course sleep, but just be able to relax even when I'm resting and just be at ease and be at peace with myself and my surroundings, you know. Well, we want to offer our resources here at the doctors to help you all process everything you've been through. And really starting with, with Dr. Lipov, who I know you came all the way here because you heard all of their stories. And I, I know in your heart and soul, and I actually believe it too, that, that your treatment can help them. I believe that's true. I, I think um, I, would, I would love to offer to treat all of you guys. Now, I'm in Chicago. It's not too far, hopefully. And we'd like to treat you. And you will, hopefully, everybody will do great. And we'll, make, you know, we'll make sure that any travel and logistics is all taken care of. I really, truly hope and pray that, that the three of you can find some, some peace in all of this because your stories are as compelling as any I've ever heard. We'll have a final word when we come back.